Hello, my friends, and welcome back to our continued blind let's play The Legend of Dragoon for PlayStation. My name is the Flatless Bird. This is your story based gaming channel, and today we're rocking the party of Hashla and Rose. Mostly because I haven't been using Hashla at all, and I don't want him to fall too far behind. Although, without Dragoon Spirits, it's. It, it's one of those things where. I, I really don't know if this is a smart idea. Like, the more I think about it, the more I think this is not the best thing we should do. I'm thinking we should really bring Shauna, just so she doesn't fall behind on the EXP. Because if we look at the levels, we're all at 14, and Shauna's at 11. And that's not good. And even though you're not really getting a whole lot of EXP per fight, it adds up over time. So I may actually replace Hashel here. I think I'm going to keep Rose, because she does have that new addition more and more. And, uh, yeah, we have a new party member replacing Lavitz, although Lavitz can never be replaced in our hearts. Ah, oh, I love that guy. He was so good. He was so, so good. But I may have to use Lavitz here as well sometime. Just, you know, just to just give him the, the, you know, the spotlight. But yeah, we're, uh, we're basically almost about, I would imagine we're closing up chapter one. I mean, we've been chapter one for almost 13 hours, and we're going after the Emperor. I don't know where the game's gonna go from here, though. I'm, I mean, do we successfully take down Emperor, and Lloyd gets away, and he becomes the new big bad? I mean, he's already kind of the big bad. At least in my eyes, he killed Lavitz, the stupid bastard. <sighs> Let's get started, shall we? I hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. Are you ready to go into the Black Castle? Yes, I think we're ready. Yeah, we are ready. The only thing left is to make it to the Black Castle. I almost gave up when I heard Bale was taken. I thought all my campaign was vain. But I found out you were alive. Your Majesty, we can still fight. I can now see the future. Good luck. Yes, I will defeat Dole and end the war. To prevent a repetition for the sorrow of you and Salas. Well, I guess I'll be serious for the first time in a while. Hey. For the people who desire peace, I'll fight. I'm going ahead. Wait, did she just... Rose? Did she just leave my party? I mean, she does have the fewest additions, Flightless. Did she actually just leave my party? No, okay, she's still here. Ah, uh, do I want to take Hashel? It's level 13, oh man. Like, both these guys are higher levels than the rest. That's the weird thing. All right, fine, fine, fine. I, I've, I've talked myself out of this. The, the, the party that I was going to use, I'm no longer going to use, it's, Ah, uh, it's... I, I mean, it's it's just one of those things, I guess, where... Where you look at it, and you look at the levels, and you want to try to balance everything, and it just doesn't work. Okay, Dart has all his additions now. So we probably want to go for... This is 102 SP? That is ridiculous. I, I want to go for Volcano, though, because of the higher damage of Volcano, and then... I think once we get to a boss, we shift to Burning Rush because the SP is just out of this world. And as for Mr. Albert, uh, Gust of Wind Dance, I think that's something that I can usually do when it's got 240% damage percentage, which is just ridiculous. So yeah, let, let's rock this. Man, I hate being indecisive. It's, it's, it's just one of those things. Oh, we can climb down there. Yeah, let's go down this one because it looks like there's a chest down there. Question is, is that blue marker going to change to a different color, or are we free to explore here? Uh, acquired 20 gold. It's not. It's amazing how you get, like, really bad rewards in this game. Now, I know 20 gold is not a small amount compared to a lot of other games. 20 gold is actually decent. But at the same time, why are you getting so low, so little? I mean, should you get like 100 gold 
or something. Okay, it looks like I want to go down this way. Because this way may have something in these barrels. Uh, nope, it does not. Alright, it looks like we have free rain here. I haven't seen any encounters. I haven't seen our blue uh, indicator shift. Going down everywhere just to check. I imagine we'll be dealing with guards inside the castle. It's like the calm before the storm, as it were. There's nothing to the left. I was thinking maybe there was something over there because... And again, I was trying to go left and I accidentally clicked on that. I was trying to see if there was stuff over there, but there is not. Looks like the whole thing here is just 20 gold. Uh, I don't know if I said this yet, but I hope you all having a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. Work has been... work as of late. Uh, not bad. Just tiring, if that makes sense. Like, you can have a good day at work and come home and feel tired. And that's kind of how I've been feeling the past couple days. It doesn't help that it's ridiculously hot outside, and that just drains you so rapidly. And so when you get home after being out, it, it, you just feel exhausted. That's why there's only one video going up today. So, let's make it a good one, yeah? What do we got? Oh, we got wolves now. Or pups. Hellhounds. The Knight of Sandoras. Uh, I believe these are fire elements, which... You know, we don't have any water elements, so... I really don't know what we're gonna do about that. I could shut down one of these guys right away, which may not be a bad idea. Let's shut down the Hellhound. I mean, I could have waited to use that to try to get more heals off, or I could use it now and basically cut damage. That seemed faster. Maybe it's just my imagination, but that seemed faster. Nope, nope, nope. It's just me. It's just me. I mean, when he wins two in a row, that that's... You can't blame the computer for that flightless bird. That That's all on you, buddy. <laughs> now, the problem with not having as high much SP... And go in volcano. volcano. Even though you're doing more damage, uh, having more SP makes it so that you get your dragon levels faster. Okay, don't want to heal this. I really don't heal right now. That seemed different. I don't know why. That seemed different, though. I mean, I'm just imagining it, but I feel like those last four attacks came out at a faster speed than what uh, Lavitz's attacks came out as. Like, normally it's two attacks, then it's two, and then it's two. That felt like two and then four. And yeah, absolutely, we're gonna fight every enemy we see. I mean, that's kind of what I do. I like to call it natural grinding. And what that means is you just fight the fights that you fight along the way. And if you do that, then you're coming out ahead. She's way under level, but still, that hurt. Yes. I'm doing really bad here today. Like, so bad. Like, that feels so different. I don't know why. It may just be my subconscious. It just feels different. I wonder if I should get rid of her power ring. Because her power ring is really useful for extra damage. But at the same time... 
At the same time, how much does she actually... How much do I actually rely on her damage? Whereas if I give her a healing item, that may keep her in the fight longer. Because a lot of times, uh, she takes one hit. I gotta instantly heal, you know? I'm surprised how little damage Dart is doing. It's because these are fire elements and he's a fire element. But I, I just feel like... She like like he's doing a lot less damage than what he should be doing. Which makes me go, well, if I'm doing less damage than I think I'm doing, why don't I just dedicate all my, all that I do to try to get his, uh, get more dragon levels. Spark that. I mean, the faster I get all the, dra uh, the dragon levels, the more powerful he's gonna be. Round and round we go. <laughs> That was it's just in a running in place. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, it would have been funny if he like came around and just started chasing me. I just did like loops with him nonstop. That would have been great too. Oh, okay, okay, buddy. Yeah, I really feel like I should give her the healing ring. But then again, when we fight bosses, having that extra magic attack is very good, too. But if I have the healing ring, I can attack her with her more, and therefore I can boost her SP more. I still want to say that's faster. Oh, he recovers HP. Okay, that, that's that's okay with by me. Yes. Not only am I getting a ton of SP from those attacks, but it's also it's also a very easy attack pattern. Although I really wish I had a different move that I could evolve with right now. Because that would be better. I wonder how much damage she can do. So she does 47. So she does 47 on a shot with her ring. I mean, with the uh, the power ring. Uh, if I take that off, how, how much damage would she do on a Hellhound? I want to test this out. Okay, so if I use the therapy ring, I go down 10 hit po uh, 10 attack points. But it's only physical attack. So therefore her magic attacks aren't affected. I thought it was physical and magic. It's not. Yeah, it, it's not magical attack, so it may not be that big of a deal if I go to a boss and she's firing away with her with her magical moves. Mostly, I just really, 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 really want to try to get XP caught up to someone else at, at least a little bit faster. counter really it's fantastic I wonder if Albert's uh, stats are still the same as are still the same okay I know I need to hit the nice and door but I'm hit the hellhound just to see the damage I'm guessing 42 okay 37 so that's that's a drop of 10 damage points but it's only physical damage I don't think that's really that big of a deal. Kind of annoyed by him healing because now the Hellhound's going to attack. 
Maybe we should just take care of this guy first. Oh my gosh, that, that camera angle just threw me off. The, the way it zoomed in like that, I, I had no idea where the uh, the counter was. I mean, the, uh, the indicator. He's just healing himself on the stop. Takes care of the dog. Dang. Like I said, I feel like that's faster now. I really need to save up for the uh, uh, the, the one that lets me do instant additions. Yeah, the ten thousand gold item. That way I can level up those additions that I struggle with, and it also will help with the grind. Because if I have to grind additions, that takes me a lot longer. But if I can do them instantly, it'd be a lot easier. So I can go down or I can go up a ladder. Which way do I go? Because it could also go to the castle as well. I like her speed. That's one thing that's very nice, because if you can open up with this, you basically take away three attacks from them instantaneously. Too early, way too early. Like way too early. And again, that's why I wish I had that item. Because every single time I miss, that's one extra EXP that I miss out on. And if it's consistent where I'm getting that EXP all the time, then it'll level up his additions faster. Seriously. <laughs> I wish you could see your progress to your next dragon level. Maybe there's a way to do that. I just don't know it, but that would be cool. Do I go up? Do I go down? I mean, I imagine you have to go towards the castle. So what if we go away from the castle? Quite a pallet. It's better to withdraw now. Anything up here? Yes, another treasure chest. Quite a burnout. Really the, the most useful items. Especially a burnout when the enemies are fire based. Okay, so do we go towards the castle or above the castle? Uh, let's go up. I have a feeling up is the correct path. But at the same time, it feels right. Really weird camera angle. Now the good news though is, uh, the enemies don't seem to respawn here. So if I kill the enemies, I have more freedom to explore. If I want to go back to the front of the castle, I can go back to the front of the castle without any, any worries at all. Wow, Shana actually did not go first. That's surprising.
I was taking um, Albert was taking some shots. I really like these enemies. They don't counter you, which is <laughs> fantastic. I don't gotta worry about that. You see what happens when you take away the counter? My 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 execution becomes much cleaner. Now I'm not gonna say my execution is perfect because obviously you've seen me fight today and you know my execution ain't perfect. I'm just saying it's cleaner. I was gonna laugh if I missed that one. <laughs> Cause that's like the easiest one to do. Uh yeah, go ahead and attack. I don't want to kill this one without guarding once with Albert so I can get some more HP back. Uh, nah. Let, let him finish it off. Oh! Well, apparently they heard me talk about counters. <laughs> like, no, what is bird? We can still counter. Uh, so there's nothing up here. The inside is darkened by soot. 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 They burnt something in here. Okay. Does this take me to the front? It does. Cool. All right. That's nice to know because now I know that I'm not missing out on going this way or this way, they take you to the same exact spot. Which means the only way to go is right. What the heck is that? What is this? Yeah, exactly. You are? Is your name Sid? Wrong franchise. Uh, are you here to see my research? Or? To visit me. Either way, we are pleased. We'd like one mercenary like you have an interest in our research. Indeed, recently barbaric suicidal attacks have become common. But if our research is successful, we'll reduce the casualties of war. For example, that white flame. Oh. Has a healing power. And that green flame isn't extinguished by water. When when we put it to practical use, it'll provide an advantage in war. But I've never seen such tech But I've never seen such technologies. It's like like magic. Ah, oh, you don't need to know about that. There are already enough of us involved in this accursed research. Yes, your job is to fight. There are too many things we don't know about this power. If you get involved too much, you might end up like Mr. Magi. Or Magi. Or Maggie. Mr. McGee? Mr. McGee. <laughs> it's too late for that guy. We have to complete this research before it's too late for Sindora. I see. I will end the war, but can we ask you a little more? For example, what kind of function does this purple flame serve? Ah, uh, this flame is a power source of the castle. The purple flame drives the elevators and lifts. It helps people's lives? That's the proper way of usage. But the war decides the usage now. Yeah, well, even if the technology can be used for the happiness of the people, once it's used wrongly, it may bring unhappiness. What we are making may bring unhappiness to the people in Basel. I agree. Research is, after all, based on the calamity caused by the dragon. War creates catastrophe. It's a sad thing for both the people and the dragon. The dragon? The dragon is involved in this research. Oh, I slipped my tongue. Forget what I said. Now, back to the research. Let me give you some magic oil. This is a fuel for the purple flame. It gives you mobility. So you remember they burnt things. Uh, that must be the thing they burned. If you want to be healed, come visit me anytime. Thank you very much. It was very useful. I will say I love Albert's uh, 
character design. He looks really cool. I mean, I love green. And uh, green cyan, and his color is cool. Are you using the magical oil? You can light the pearl flame with it. I, mean, I don't think I need healing, but at the same time, uh, someone said it. You want to be healed, don't you? Quiet, slowly close your eyes. Now. Well, back to the research. Okay, um, I could go to the right, but I want to come down here first. Nothing over here. Or here, and yes, I am checking the bookshelves. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There you go. I thought I was interacting with the purple light. I don't think you can. Okay, let's, before we go right, which is what I think is the right way to go, uh, let's double back. Guys, sit back. Maybe the way to go is straight up there. I mean, that's, that seems very likely, right? I mean, they're guarding something. But at the same time, the game strongly suggests we want to go right. Uh, I hate it when I don't know which way to go. Like, I hate missing out on stuff, or I hate having to double back for stuff. Yes. Whoa, that's so early. 14 damage, that's, that's sad. Ridiculous. And so they want a level two. Burning rush. It's funny, ever since I put that ring on, she's not gotten hit. <laughs> Part of that is because I've been lucky that they've been healing. That was 224 damage. Good lord out there. That is nuts. Uh, did he get to level... No, he, there's no way he got to level up recently. He just did a ton of damage to that wolf for some reason. Oh, that hound. Yeah, it's still level 2. Uh, 32 or 40. 240%. Man. His damage numbers are just off the charts. They're gonna went the right way. Or did I go the wrong way? Because it looks like progress. You, who are you? I know, you are thieves who come to steal my magic. Wait, we are... No excuse! Watch out, we don't know what he'll do. Let him. It seems interesting. Take this! The steel sharing vacuum blade! <laughs> I love how they built this all up. Why? Why doesn't my magic work? Why does it cheer them? It's worse than I thought. That was still in research. I'll show you this. Take this rock crushing thunder arrow. Look at Dart. He's just like, and Hashel's cracking up. <laughs> I see you are the researcher. It's too late, aren't you? Then Mr. Maggie is. Huh? Those dumb researchers are trash. They still said somebody here, did they? Wow, I actually knew that line before it was said. It just felt natural. Leave us alone. We are not here to criticize your research. Ah, shut up! I have already made the discovery. The secret magic is uh, that those losers could never even hope to know. The magic of transformation can only be known by myself, who completely understands uh, the magical power of dragons. I'll show it to you now. Cerberus, emerge! It seems real this time. Uh oh. Whoa! Oh, he's adorable. Aww. That 
was expecting a giant three-headed dog. <laughs> Aww. I wonder, is this dog Mr. Maggie? I guess it requires more research to be controlled by humans. But at least in the end, he amused us. <laughs> this is so weird, and I love it so much. Acquired blue stone? I thought that was a dragon spirit at first. I was like, did we just find a dragon spirit? Uh, no. The, the answer is no. Uh, what does a blue stone do? Oh. Goods? Here it is. Blue stone held by the ma spellmaster Magi. Or Magi. So it looks like we were supposed to. Aww. Oh, die. What are you doing? Okay, I think I've bothered Mr. Magi enough. Okay, so it looks like this was progress. But I'm not locked out of anything because. I guess this is where you're supposed to go. The question is... The big question is, do I go up there? Which seems like the most heavily guarded area in the in the, uh, the place. Or do I go off to the right here, which doesn't seem to be guarded? Nobody can become happy without making someone else unhappy. That is universal truth. I disagree. Happiness exists only on top of somebody else's happiness. I, I don't believe in that. What is it called? Zero sum theory, I think it is. We are just studying the principle of magic of Emperor Dole. We don't know how Emperor Dole obtained the principles of magic. I don't want to have people feel there's a crisis, so please not tell anybody what you have seen or heard in here. The fact that we are using a dragon is particularly controversial and dangerous. Please do not tell anybody. We're going deeper and deeper, which is good because if we're going to fight Ember Dolt, we should go to the main area, right? So I feel like this is... What the heck was that? I have a feeling there's going to be a sequence I got to pass. Trains? Light? Dark Mist. Oh, these are probably attack items. I am worried about our attacks, though. I mean, our item use, though, because we're at 31 and 32. Uh, let's see. Yeah, darkness based individual and light based individual. I mean, look at all these attack items we have. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of a burnout. Just because most enemies in here seem to be fire based. Now, the problem is, do I wanna go across this knowing that I may have to double back, or do I do it anyway? I think I kind of do it anyway. Quite a redstone. Oh, it's dangerous. You cannot come in. Although I give you credit for making it through. I only have garbage, but make yourself at home. Oh, it's dangerous. You cannot come in. Okay, he says the same thing twice. Is he gonna drop me? Yep. <laughs> I saw that coming. That wasn't that hard of a puzzle, though. I thought that would be a lot more difficult because you have only a certain amount of time. And you had to go certain ways, but I mean, that felt just perfectly. Okay, we now have the redstone and we now have the blue stone. And we've explored everywhere we can except the, the, the front door there. I could probably take a quick stop here, even though I don't need much HP. Uh, a little bit of HP is better than no HP. So getting that extra 30 HP is not bad. Now if I was speedrunning, I would say screw it. But I'm not speedrunning, so just take the extra second to do that. Alright, let's take these guys off. 
again. Okay. Let's shut one down as usual. And let's take out the other one. Burning rush. Now 102 SP per attack. He'll probably get his next dragoon. Very quickly. Uh, you would, you would, you would think so, right? Although once again, much rather have a new addition to be to be learning and doing and leveling. Question about Shana though. When Shana fires her bow, is that a real bow? Or is that just a wooden stick that shaped like a bow? And then when she fires, does she fire a holy like light attack? Or does she fire an actual arrow? Because graphically, it looks like it's just a wooden like curvature and there there is no bow. But yet she still shoots a magical thing out of it. So does she need the bow at all to shoot the magical thing? I mean, these are the questions that keep me up at night. <laughs> okay, I could go right or I could go left. Uh, I should have gone left because left is always right. I know better. Yeah, left is always right. Left, left is always right. Let's go left first. Okay, I could have gone up there. Oh! It like swings you around. Item shop. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's um. Uh, this is a great chance for me to unload some items as well. It's probably not worth a whole lot, but it's really good to sell. But I'm feeling. I mean, these these can be important. Uh, let's drop a healing potion because we have one, two, three, four, five, six of them with two healing breezes. Uh. Sell some of these uh, attack items. I really don't use them that often. And even though it's not worth a lot of money, it's worth some. I want to get the tens. And the translate and the dark mist could be powerful. I'm gonna go ahead and sell them. I mean, like I said, it's not much, but hey, it's an extra 20 gold. And considering we're finding 20 gold in chests, that's like basically getting a chest, right? Oh, I forgot to see if you actually have some good items though. You probably don't, but if you have a healing breeze, I would love those. Uh, nope. Uh, Spear Frost and Meteor Fall with Charm Potions. And... Yeah, okay. I don't need to buy anything. Okay, so we did a circle. There's a couple doors there, but there's also a lift here. And there's some guards fighting. Which makes me think this is probably an optional area. No, 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 I'm not thinking this is an optional area anymore. Invaders! You had such good luck to get into practice then, didn't you? Catch them! Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah. I was wrong. I was wrong! I think I just got myself into a uh, three round battle. But hey, if I'm only fighting one at a time, though, uh, they're gonna die pretty quick. Darn it. Now you may wonder why I like shutting down enemies. And the reason is, is because the amount of time it takes to defend and get your HP up is easily more than if you just shut down an enemy and you don't have to worry about healing yourself. So shutting down an enemy actually makes the combats go faster. 
At least I think so. And we got another healing potion, which is not something we needed, but we did just sell four attack items, so it's not the worst of all. But these guys are unbelievable. Don't think. We are Knights of the Tandor, so just defeat them. I love how they come one at a time. It's, it's kind of funny. When there's three of us, there's three of you. Why don't we just make it a three on three fight instead? They're the honorable ones. So we're the dishonorable ones. Uh -huh. That's something I wonder about when you play RPGs. You know, you have a party and uh, there's this one boss and it's like a three on one. It's always going to be three on one or it's a four on one or five on one based on what game you're, you're playing. Isn't that really unfair? Yes. Like, don't you feel bad that you outnumber them by so much? But then it's a boss with a ridiculous amount of HP and everything, so you shouldn't feel bad because he's unbalanced. I mean, if there was five of them, uh, you'd be crushed, you know, into some of the rings. It's kind of the cool thing about the Forgo fight. The Forgo fight was like a three on three fight, you know? Arrgh, my last one, but I won't give up. You know, you just saw two of your friends fall and they didn't get a single, like, hit on me. You would think that might be a good opportunity to say, uh, screw you guys, I'm going home. But instead you're like, no, 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 no I got this, I, I got this. No, you don't got this. And what do they say about learning history? So don't, like, repeat your same mistakes. Wow, that was horrible. It's funny because even when he messes up, or I mess up his attacks, I should say, uh, he's still doing a ton of damage. I mean, he did more damage on those two hits than Dart just did. Please don't kill. Cool, I want it one more turn. Excellent. Well, we took care of that. Uh, should I continue on? I don't think I want to go up. Okay, that guy looks scary as heck. I want to talk to him? Great coming in, Sindora. You are here, the girl from Celeste. You said the girl from Celeste? You, you took me away to Helena. Indeed, I'm the one who assaulted Celeste under the orders of Emperor Dole. So you killed everybody. That was done by the brutal unit lord of the Forgo. I wouldn't let them kill unnecessarily if I were there. Anyway, it doesn't change the fact that Imperial Sindora supports Celeste. If you want revenge for your home, you can draw your sword against me, but at least do me one favor. His Majesty Dole changed after a man called Lloyd showed up. He must have instilled something into Emperor Dole. A demonic war that ignites his desire to vanquish. You were able to make it here, so you might be able to do it. I beg you, wake Emperor Dole up. Huh. You understand what will result? Yes, if you can accomplish that, the Imperial Sindor's dominance will end, and he even might we may even be defeated by Basil. But the result will be the same if the current oppression of Emperor Dole continues. So you might as well make it happen faster and move the hardships on our people. There was a man like this in Sindora. Lyrits would be happy to hear this. So, are you in? Well, that's what we're here for. I'm relieved to hear that. Now, take this with you. Is another stone? What is this? It's a key to the chamber of Emperor Dole. Let me guess, you need how many stones? Oh yeah, we have no time. There is nothing I can do anymore. I beg you, wake Emperor Dole up. How do you get to that? Is that arrow over there? Hmm. Let's continue on, right? Okay, that's definitely progress. Well, let's double back around. I mean, for all we know, we have to get all the stones, right? Because they're a key. 
Uh, move to second floor. Wonder what the fourth floor is. We'll have to go back and check that out. But now let's go in here. There's nothing in there. Uh, let's go up here. Oh, that was it. I thought there was like more here. Could have came here a long time ago. All right, uh, let's try this uh, fourth floor, shall we? Seems like a secret. But is it? I mean, what is the save point up there? Uh, let's save the game. And we'll talk to this guy. I mean, we, we, it looks like you had to have the, uh, the, the stones in order to get to Emperor Dole. So what does that mean? That means that... Oh, this is probably the stones. Three holes, what are they? They might do something with the statue of the goddess. Why do you think so? Because look. It seems this place is for mining the statue. There must be something. Yeah, you're supposed to put the stones in those holes. Okay. So this is indeed the way to Emperor Dole. Um, which means there's still a lot more that we want to do. It's locked. I wonder if there's some trick. So I guess that you put in the three stones in that door unlocks. Father Faza. Oh, it's usually I have guessed this time, but it's fine. Let me talk to you. The long war decays people's hearts. It must happen to you too. The bloodstained armor tells all. However, His Majesty Dole has also experienced the fatigue of war. All the dots. The statue of goddess was created in memory of the late wife of Emperor Dole, Empress Karina. It shows the frailty and fondness of Emperor Dole. So it sounds like it was a good man, then he lost his wife, and then Lloyd came along and poisoned his mind. He, however, continues the war for his own ambitions with increasing scenes of carnage. It shows his strength and coolness. Strength and frailty, fondness and coolness. You must have them inside you. Because the human heart can develop them all. Face up to your true self, then you will become as strong as Emperor Dole. Or maybe he wasn't such a nice guy. That's all I want to say. If you're lost, come visit me in time. I'll help you find the way. Okay, let's go back and up and around. But you know, the, the stones were optional. But then again, I was told the stones are the way to the Emperor. I mean, and there's a save point there. You're not going to put a save point unless it's before a boss. So unless we find a second save point, then we know that that's probably progress. Uh, I took the chance hoping that Shana would go next. I mean, before anyone else, but uh, it's fine. Flightless, be better. Yeah, having that passive health is cool because now I can attack with her. Seventeen to uh, heal with her with uh, defense. You keep recovering the HP. That just means I have to hit you with Albear. Dang it! 
These are the easiest things to do. Missed? Come on, dart. experience it's not a lot uh you know she's getting what like 11 for combat compared to if she was in the reserves which you'd be getting that guy looks different that was, almost looks like a ninja of sorts yeah that guy's definitely different and we go first so you know what we're gonna do we're just gonna shut him down Did good damage there. I think he's a water element. That might be why. I'm a little upset with that one because I, I I really feel like I did the right timing on that one. It's a Nora Elite. Definitely looks really cool. That's unfair game. That is really unfair. Like, that is so unfair. I mean, that's not even close to being fair. Let's make sure she doesn't die again. I know I could have maybe have killed her. I mean, killed it with uh, Shana, but that was a risk I wasn't going to take. Especially as the game can be really cool sometimes. That guy was ridiculous. And only gave 30? Man, that's, that's, that's lame. Super lame. Spinning Gale. Don't we already don't we already have that? That's like a spear, right? No, we have Twister Glaive. Spinning Gale is not a weapon, which means it is probably an attack item. Yep, it's an attack item. I wish I could move things. I would love to move Magic Six Stone to the uh the top. Okay, where is this gonna take me? Always does it take me out of this place, because that would be bad. Where am I? Workers are saying all sorts of things, but I believe Emperor Dole. Magic will become a power for everybody. Maybe Emperor Dole can do it. I actually don't know what we are making, but this must be something to do with the war. But I want to help them fight, but if I resist against Dole. Quiet spirit ring. Dude, dude, dude. Thank you. Spear frost. Probably another attack on him. White flames, green flames, and purple flames. They all just made for the war. They are not something that can make us happy. Magic is silly. It's just a tool of war. 
Of course, they always do the magic for war. Are they doing anything to achieve victory? That's stolen. Okay, I believe we've gone everywhere now, right? Yeah, we've gone down there. Been across this way. I'm unsure if we went down here. Okay, we've been here. Uh, you know what I should do? Uh, that guy's a merchant, right? Uh, I should uh, heal up. One, two, three, four, five healing potions still. I think that's plenty of healing potions. We don't need to buy any more. Famous last words, right? But yeah, I think we are on our way now. Uh, I think we've been everywhere. And after we enter these three stones, this door will probably unlock. All them fit. Phaser is putting the stone. The door opened. I got it. Okay. Uh, last save before we uh put the emperor, I imagine. And we already got a time, but this is the only video that I'm doing today. But I do have to render it till it's night third. I gotta go to bed soon. Ah. I want to I want to press on now I mean when you're playing a game that you really like playing I want to keep going Huh Stay back. I smell blood in this air This is not human Congo! Oh. Oh my god. What in the world are you wearing? Gagados don't lose twice. Gagados make payback for hopes. For His Majesty, Dole! Okay, I don't think I'll be able to fight both him and the Emperor in one. Dang, I'm so close to getting resolution here. That almost looks like my favorite summon from uh, Legend of Gaia. Remember a little pup? That's almost exactly what it looked like there. Okay, question. He's Earth, I think? Which means we probably want to launch with Albert? But I really love his defense down, so if we launch with him, it's not as smart. Because we're only gonna get one turn. Or I could not use the defense up and just fight him without it and just go for max damage. Let me go ahead and defend here and get some life back. Uh, Shauna? Why don't you just go ahead and hit this guy? We do have items. And uh, we do have this uh, multi win thing here. Nice. That's a good start. Alright, let's go super special with Albert here. Yeah. 
I don't even know if this is a smart move either because Albert's magic deck probably not as good as what Shauna can do. Well, let's see how much it does. If it doesn't do enough, I'll just use this defense ability. But I mean, if this does 200, I may use it twice. And yes, I'm expecting 200 because, you know, I'm, I, I powered up on him. Okay, 200, cool. That's kind of what I was hoping for. Will he be defended? So this ain't so bad. Maybe I should do the defense anyway. I mean, he's got those spinning things. I can only imagine these spinning things are gonna nullify damage. Uh, but it's worth a shot, isn't it? I don't know what I'm fighting. That's a problem. Yeah, it's worth a shot. I have a feeling these little crystals are gonna take the place of a damage. Which would suck because that would nullify my specials. The effect of the magic is destroyed. Yeah, I mean, it took the place of it like I thought. Uh, do we do final burst here or do we just attack? It is a fire strength 75%, but if we just attack, it's probably 100%, right? Uh, let's, let's use final burst and let's see what the damage is and let's compare it to his regular attack. It is pretty, at least. What do we got? Wow. Oh my god. Okay. That worked. I really wish I would have gone Super Saiyan with him instead of, uh, instead of Albert. So what's the plan here? The plan here is to get rid of that by doing a Star Child work, or could we just regularly attack it? Should have done... Should have done the uh, moon, uh, the children, the the ability, the, the spell. Well, maybe this will blow it away. And if this blows it away, we know Dark can do 300 damage with his uh his explosion attack. So yeah. Again, I, I missed it. That it annoys me. I should have used special just on Dart or on, or on Shauna. I would have gotten more out of it. But uh, it is what it is. really good wow we won with that holy cow we just decimated him 200 gold and 2,000 experience that's beautiful Shana is gonna level up from that which is great dark does as well Albert does as well any additions uh, yes yeah new addition crush dance it's probably gonna be impossible to do but it's a new addition Gargantos was strongest armor lost. Me, brother of hero, has pride. Cannot live in disgrace. Kill 
me. As you wish. Stop it. Wait, what are you doing? This guy tried to kill us like multiple times. The game is already over. Game, don't be silly. This is a matter of life or death. It's over. He cannot fight. Alright, well, okay, yeah, I mean, they do have a point. He is kind of... Hope your sweetness will kill you. Oh, this guy's just gonna get, keep coming after us. Although, I much rather have an RPG where the, uh, the, the bad guy is defeated and says, Okay, you defeated me, now kill me, rather than an RPG where the bad guy just keeps coming back and back and back and back and back. He, he magically runs away, you know what I mean? Me lost, why are you kind to me? Okay, uh, unfortunately, as I said, I don't have time to do the uh, the fight with... I'm assuming Dole. But it very well could be Lloyd. Now that I think about it. But re regardless of who I'm, I'm... I'm ending up the fight here. We're gonna have to wait for the next episode. I know that sucks, but we're already over an hour. And unfortunately, it's... It is what it just has to be. Uh, but hey, I love you all so very much. Thank you for everything. You all are the number one YouTube community all of YouTube and I can't thank you enough. So yeah, um, this is our continued buying let's play of Legend Dragoon. Before we go, just let's look at Crush Dance here. Uh, level one has four additions. Great. Uh, 50 SP and the same amount of damage as Burning Rush. So yeah, this definitely needs levels. Kind of think I should just go with Burning Rush for now. Because leveling up a new addition on a boss may be a really bad idea. Additionally, I don't have any SP now. Well, I have 100 SP with Dart. But no one on anyone else. I, I, I really get the feeling what I should do is go back and try to... Try to see if I can get any of those guards to spawn. And, uh, you know, get more SP on all my guys. So I can go into the fight with full SP. I I'll think about it. But, yeah. I, I, I will see you guys again very soon. Until then, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.